What's up guys? So today's video is reaction from Damo's Live uh, pertaining Lou Valentino and Jayla Corian. Um, there's been a lot of mix going on, a lot of craziness has been going on, a lot of drama, I guess. Um, but Lou disappeared, I guess, you know, after everything, everything went down. Um, his friendship with Damo literally, like, didn't last. And Jayla put out a, put, Jayla put out a, a video um, stating that everything that they everything that they were doing the storyline was fake and they was just pretending for the views and for their new music videos um, She had a lot to say she had a lot to say about 20 minutes worth of I guess what others would consider tea She had a lot to say she had text she had text messages. Um, I guess evidence of Exchange messages of between her and Lou and Damo. So here's what Damo had to say after Jayla released the video just watch and I'll try to come in in between but you guys let me know exactly what you think all this is going on. Like, because right now everything is just a mess. So let's get to it. My point is, everything was before me and Lou start liking each other. We I don't think you should let some extra girl that wants attention ruin y'all friendship. That's my point. I acted off emotion. Which I told you, I still got stuff to work on within myself. Um, and that's why I'm just choosing. Even if me and Lou ever decide anything, ain't nobody about to know. Because I feel like y'all will find out on my wedding day. And I'm not saying it's to Lou. But I'm saying, like, if I ever date anybody, y'all gonna see the wedding pictures. And I'm gonna pop up. Y'all gonna be like, oh, shit. <laughs> this deep. Like, I'm dead serious. Because... This is definitely trial and error, though. That's how I feel. And I'm not going to sit here and, like, down the other girl. But I just really, really wish that, like, she could, it could have been different. That's all I'm, that's all I, it could have been different. I feel bad for you. I feel bad for myself because <laughs> it's like the first person I decide to actually like, like as an individual. <sighs> Quite honestly, I am a bit disappointed and um on how everything just played out. Um, because yeah, we support her, you know, and some support him and others support Jayla, you know, and everybody else that's in this mix. But um. It is the fact that she finally looked like she was happy with somebody and now this. So it's like video was put out, then it was deleted. And then messages were, were posted up, you know, was deleted. Tweets were deleted. Like if there's nothing going on, you know, like just F it. Let everybody think what they want to think and just do what you got to do. It shouldn't matter, you know, other people's opinion. If you're happy, just be happy. But if you're really doing it for... You know, if they really are doing it for the clout, you know, regardless if it's Jayla that's just saying stuff or Damo that's saying stuff, Lou that's doing and saying stuff, regardless of the fact, um, it shouldn't be like that. It shouldn't be like that at all. Just be honest with your just be honest with your friends because once the truth comes out, everybody's gonna leave, and that's just how it goes. That's just how it goes. Everybody sticks around for the drama, um, or depending if they really like you for you, then they'll stick around. Like period, they'll just watch your videos. But you guys shouldn't have to. He should was well, specifically him. He shouldn't have to use other people's. You know, or anybody shouldn't have to use other people just for, just for the come up. Yes, I understand it's a business and that's, you know, the industry, that's how it goes and stuff like that. Well, for most part, for most people. But it's the same way as buying subscribers and buying fans, I guess. It's kind of like that. Um, but it's just a whole lot of mess. Yes, more. goes to the poop. But it's not his fault and I'm going to defend him. At first, I did think it was his fault and I was going crazy. On, not crazy, but I was like. I was mad because I'm like, why would you do this at the same time? And he didn't. When I looked at the dates, they didn't add up. So, I know. I know what was going on. That's why I'm making this live right now. So, um, yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Funny thing is, I was excited. If you guys could check out my last video, it, it will it'll be in the end screen. I was very excited thinking that, okay, Lou has changed and, you know, and they're about to be a couple. Everything is all cute and, you know, all exes are left in the past, everything that was done. And then this unfolds. And I really don't think these, these dramas are going to end anytime soon, but let's just hope it does. If it does not, then I just think that 
everyone that's involved in this situation, they should just pretty much go hide out like Lou's doing. You know, just take a break from the internet because sometimes it's too overwhelming, you know. Just just live your life, but just let everything die off and then just, just stay off. But Damo doesn't really seem bothered about everything that's going on. I don't know. It could be deeper than that, but continue. Why don't you follow him on Instagram? I don't follow him when she sent me those screenshots. And I was like, screenshots don't lie. But guess what? Neither do dates. That part got me confused. She said, screenshot doesn't lie, you know, or date. Which is correct. Screenshot does not lie. But according to Jada, um, she does have messages between her and Damo. You know, with her saying, and Lou saying, like, you know, they're just gonna fool everybody, you know, you know, and then bam, they're gonna drop their music video and stuff like that. But um, if Screenshot doesn't lie, you know, I just hope that, you know, there's the truth. There is the truth. There's, there's the lie, and then there's the truth. So somebody's lying, somebody's telling the truth, somebody's hiding something, and somebody's really showing us exactly what's going on. So you guys let me know who you think, who, who are you going for, and who do you think is right and who you think is wrong honestly right i'm a bit little i'm a little confused just a little bit confused only because there, there are screenshots that's the main reason why i'm confused because there are screenshots and lou all of a sudden disappear he's not on the instagram anymore you know his facebook like everything is just like totally just deactivated for now so i don't know i don't i don't know i don't know so yeah stay friends with him and chill that's my plan that's my plan it's just the fact that everybody think not everybody my bad this girl thinks that this was a storyline. And originally, <laughs> exactly. Hmm. Hmm. Originally, we weren't supposed to like each other. We were literally supposed to collab, just be a YouTube together, just be freaking friends. That's it. When it turned to friends, Feeling. Anybody know um, exactly what that means? Um, there are friends, and then there's friends with feelings. So I'm guessing, would that consider to be friends with benefits? Um, if so, you guys comment down below and let me know. But I, I, yeah, I'm I'm just as speechless as you are. I, I, <laughs> when it turned to friends with a little bit of feelings in it, that's when it became. Time reading comments. Girl's gonna be mad because they ain't got him no more. That's what I realized, you know, and I think she's a very bright girl. I think she's very smart. I think that she has potential on an honest level. She's very beautiful. But it's the fact of why. That's the question I wanna know. Why? Nobody made you look dumb because all I did was post a YouTube video, didn't mention anything about you, and you got jealous. This story is just keeps getting more and more confusing. Um, it does make sense what she's saying. Maybe the girl did get, maybe Jayla, not the girl, she does have a name, but maybe Jayla does, like, maybe she is a little bit jealous. You know, the fact that Lou moved on to somebody else, maybe, but then again, Lou does have a past um maybe like like they everybody's been saying you know his ex and everybody is to collab with that he says the right thing he does the right thing to make you fall for him and stuff and i just hope that maybe you know she didn't fall into the trap where now she's just like damn i like this dude so much and maybe he is telling me the truth and stuff and on the other hand um a guy will lie to you but a girl most will tell you the truth believe it or not a girl will tell you the truth exactly how it is like yeah i was with him yeah we were together yeah he said this and that but then again he does she does have proof um, text messages between her and Lou where him saying, yo, I'm just using her and all that stuff. But then again, if she knew about it already that they was going to do this fake storyline, like, so why would you be mad now, I guess? Like, why be mad? Because they said it, okay, let's say, for example, yes, they did say they was going to make the fake storyline. They made the fake storyline. They made the video, you know, and they kept everybody guessing so we could, you know, so the next video could, so, so we could watch the next video. It worked. But you can't be mad. You can't, I guess she can't really be mad because of the fact that she knew about it also. So even if, if the, the story is fake, um, everybody is in on it, I'm guessing. But you guys let me know. This, this is just like mind-blowing. This is, this is crazy. This is um, pretty much Damo and Chrissy all over again. That's, that's pretty much what it is. Like, it's that type of drama, I guess. But, um. That's the reality. Like, you came to me pretending like everything. 
everything was at the same time and it wasn't and I didn't want to put you out there in a the video yesterday because I felt like I was I wasn't I'm not that type of person I want to handle this how I've, how I've handled stuff in the past you know I'm growing maturing more um yeah I'm single that's what people like when she came out she was acting like we was in a relationship like we ever had sex before no that was y'all I never did anything and I don't bash girls for having sex. Screw a T. This drama, this 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 is what this drama literally this You know what I'm saying? People some people just do that one day or one month. But I feel like myself no. You know what I'm saying? Oop, friendship first, you know? And I don't know. That's just my take on it, like. Don't drop your energy. No, my energy is not dropped, y'all. <laughs> my energy is good, I promise, I promise. I'm just sitting here thinking like, dang, how, this is what I get for listening to people. I always tell people, um, don't listen to other people, and for the most part, I really don't, 99% of the time. Whoever, either it's Jayla, um, Damo, or Lou, Whoever's doing this for the cloud and stuff, it's just like, it's not genuine of the fact that once people find stuff out, once people find things out, they tend to leave, you know? And um, it's better to just be yourself, you know, show your daily life. It's kind of like a reality TV show, um, but it's just you. You upload whenever you want and you do whatever you want. But if you got it, once you start faking things, lying about things, regardless of who's lying or who's telling the truth or whatever the case is, um, once the truth is found out, everybody's going to leave, like I said before. So it's best to just stay genuine and be yourself. And, you know, the right people are going to follow you. You know, always gonna, they're always going to stick by you no matter what. But, you know, the fake will eventually leave in the real stays, believe it or not. But um, let's continue. But this 1%, I'm just like, all right. Benefit of, like, why would she come to me if it wasn't, you know? Uh, yeah. Wasn't no person ever just like um I don't she could have came to you privately that's my point I'm a cool girl you come to me and you tell me something privately respectfully I'm gonna respect you that much more but the fact that it was public it just looked bad it looked bad it's like what are your intentions why are you doing this for what who you want to see this you know, so it was just like, you don't need to explain, but it sounds like you are hurt. If y'all are just friends. Most people just don't know who to believe anymore. It's like, everybody seems to be telling the truth for some reason. So who's really lying? Somebody's telling the truth. Definitely. Somebody's telling the truth. Definitely. And somebody is lying. Definitely. But who is it? Um, you guys let me know what you think. I, this is. <sighs> it shouldn't matter. Be his friend. I am hurt because of the fact of. It got blown out of proportion. People are saying that Lou is using me. Lou is a clout chaser. It's not even what they said about me because, like, I know who I am. I'm very confident in who I am. You know what I'm saying? But the fact of Lou is taking the fall for this when we both agreed on the same thing, we were not supposed to be together. Regardless of the fact, I really, I still think that she really do have a, like, she still has strong feelings for him. And maybe she does see the good in him somehow, somewhere, or whatever the case is, regardless. Again, like I said, whoever's lying, whoever's telling the truth. But, um, they, they really, she, she really do seem to like him. Because she, nobody talks highly about somebody unless you really, unless you have strong feelings for them and respect them. And, yeah. We're not together. But we weren't supposed to like each other. Ever. It was never supposed to happen. Ever. And I guess we spent enough time with each other that it started to get to liking. We, like I said, it never crossed friendship, but it's exhausting, all right? It's exhausting. Lou said himself that he used you. We both were just collabing. What do you do when you collab? You get, your, you get their followers, you get your followers. That's what it is. You know what I'm saying? Just when the other girl hit. Lou up and was like, hey, I want to collab with you. Let's get our followers up. What was she doing? I'll wait. <laughs> I'll wait. Exactly. Exactly.
be single for as long as you can, babe. Ain't nothing better than that stress free living. Yeah, I am going to be single for a very long time. I already know that. Lou knows that. You know, that's why we were building a friendship, you know. But. <laughs> Hi. Um, I'm going to be single for a very long time. That's just what it is. So if you see me, like, what did I see that post? Uh, so I was like, if you see me, I'm single. But if you see me out with someone, mind your business. I'm doing interviews. That is me. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. Um. How I feel about this is she was cool when her and Lou were collabing, using each other. But when me and Lou collab, quote unquote, using each other, it's a problem. You cannot be hypocritical in the situation. You just can't. You can't. If you're going to come, come correct and say everything, you know, don't leave something out. It just make try to make yourself the bigger person because you're not, you know, and I don't know. It just sucks that I lost respect for her. That's how I feel. Using you is a bad choice of words. Stop being so oblivious to the situation. That's what YouTube is. That's what YouTube is. We are not in a relationship. That's what y'all like. How can I put this? If I did my girl Jasmine Brown. I love her. She does makeup. If you're on here, what's up, girl? Um... She's supposed to be doing my makeup for a video, right? I have followers. She has... I have a lot of followers. She has a lot of followers. We're using each other to build ourselves up. That's what YouTube is. Like, I'm going to collab. Like, um, I'm going to collab with a supporter, right? To help her build her channel. I don't know how many subscribers she has. Probably like 200. You use each other to gain. That's how I feel. Y'all keep asking her the same questions. Ask her something else, please. Let her breathe. <laughs> ah. She encouraged him to collab and do a song with you. Stop lying. That's not why she was mad. Yes, it is. Because she met him afterwards. And he told her straight up, this is what me and Damo are doing. Period. He told her. So the fact that she knew and she still decided to be mad about it. You can't be mad at somebody telling you some up front. That's how I feel. Like you can't. It's impossible. So. Love the nails. Thank this is just too much going on. This is just too much. Everybody just needs to take a break from the social media. I understand it's, it's your job and everything, but just, just, just take a break because it doesn't seem like things is getting any better for anybody. It's like, you know, I'm on crazy. Things just finally started to die out just a little bit more than it was from before. And now it's Lou. Lou and Damo's in a hot seat. And then now it's Lou, Damo, and Jayla in a hot seat. It's just too much, dra too much drama going on. Can we all just go back to just making pranks, making regular videos, being with our friends, being happy with our families and everything, and just making regular videos? Is it the that or just everybody just needs to take a break? That's it. Just, just, just take a break from social media for, for a little bit. It's okay. They're not going anywhere. Nobody is going anywhere. Your fans not going anywhere. Your supporters, whoever, you know, nobody's going anywhere. But to let this drama sort of like get to let to to pretty much break down this drama to let it cool down. Just everybody just needs to take a break, right? So I got them done in Florida when I was at Playlist Live. <laughs> How's Wick? I love your parenting skills and I love the way you the love you have for him. He's really good. He's in the other room watching Word World, no, Word World right now. Um, he's eating goldfish. He keeps coming in here. I'm surprised he hasn't came in here again. Um, people are always gonna hate. I know. She said she would smash you on the Smasher Pass video. I mean, like I said, I don't think she's a bad person. I just think that the way that this went along was just terrible. And the fact that she tried to make me seem like a certain person is the reason I'm live right now. She was okay with it because he told her it was a fake storyline. She felt betrayed because y'all started liking each other. When you break... Okay. I had to learn this myself. Okay. When you break up with somebody, right? It's really none of your business what the next person does. And I had to learn that the hard way. 
extremely hard y'all the whole world watched me go through that shit <laughs> and it was hard okay but what he does after her does not matter what he did before me does not matter what he does after me because we're literally just friends does not matter okay so like that's i don't know i had to act like that Oh, it's hot in here, y'all. So, if the person you are talking to for a month and he tells you that he is making a video with someone else and he begins to tell lies to mix the story, what are you gonna do? Wait, let me reread that. Ugh. So, if the person you are talking to for a month, okay, tells you he's making a video with someone else and he begins to tell lies in the mix, what are you gonna do? He told her from the jump. This is what we're doing because he met her after he met me, right? This is what I originally supposed to do. We're supposed to make videos, make music. We already made two songs, you know what I'm saying? So the fact that she knew going in what it was and she still chose to be like upset about it. They only talked for like two, three weeks. So it's, it's not like it's like. <sighs> Don't trust females. They just be jealous of your happiness. Just one month, she is tripping. Period. It wasn't years. You know what I'm saying? And they stopped talking. I will never talk to somebody who is in. Damn. You know what? You guys let me know what you think down below. Um, in the comment section, you guys let me know how you feel about this whole situation. Um, her, so... To summarize the rest of this, we gonna, I'm just gonna watch. We're just gonna watch it straight through. So during her live, within I believe 15 minutes into her live, um, and this person named Angela requests to to um to appear on her to appear in her live, and I guess I'm guessing Donald didn't know how to do it, or how, or she must have pressed the wrong thing. And as soon as I guess as soon as she realized that you can have another video and another person along with your live, she pressed something I'm guessing, and automatically the live just froze but every every all the fans were still able to comment and nobody knew exactly what happened but pretty much everybody took on so twitter and everybody was just like making jokes about it like yo angela broke her life angela broke her life so whoever didn't understand what that meant watch the rest of the video till the end and you're gonna see towards the end that's when everything just froze like she was just, she she literally froze in an awkward position like <laughs> it was very weird but um yes angela i guess they broke it but i'm oppressed must have pressed something over accident um a glitch i'm guessing it was a glitch but nevertheless let's just finish watching this re the rest of this video and you guys let me know how you feel comment down below don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for the next video but i'm just very sad and i was happy to this the last video i was excited like whoo, had the biggest smile cheeks was all up in the air to this it's just it's too much it's too much everyone just needs to take a break just take a break from, the, from social media just take a break it's okay it's like a, a mini vacation, you know, when you're working a regular job out there, when you go on vacation, you're not at work, right? So that's pretty much what everybody needs to do, and <sighs> yeah, guys, I'm out. You know what I'm saying? I feel like that's wrong. So the fact that he stopped talking to her, that's why we didn't record for a very long time. Anyways, I'm going to stop talking about this. Do a video and explain her receipts. I want to do a video, but I kind of don't because I feel like... It's gonna give her like, I feel like she's gonna feel very special, you know? And that's not how I'm trying to make her feel, but then I feel like if I make a video and explain myself, then it's gonna be like, okay, makes sense, okay. Don't give her more, Carly still. Carly, what's up, girl? What is up? He's gonna give her ammo. Exactly. That's that's my thing. So I, I'm I'm thinking about this heavy. My whole family gonna tell me not to do it. I don't think I will. I think I'm gonna just pretend like nothing happened after this live. People gonna talk shit. People gonna say what they say. But to be honest, like this life, this life. So we got friends. <laughs> don't do a video. <laughs> I'm not. I don't think I am. I don't think I am. Anyways.
Anyways, besides the situation, y'all ask me some questions. I got a, so much work to do these next two days. It's actually insane. Like, I'm about to be busy, busy, busy. <laughs> My friends just text me, don't make no video. God got you. Dang. I know. I ate some candy. My tongue is blue. Go back to your happy private life. That part. I'm definitely going back to a private life. Because you see, no, guys, use me as a test dummy. Do you see what happens when you put, even when you wait? Do you see what happens when you put stuff online? Certain stuff, obviously. Do me a favor and focus on myself. I never stop focusing on myself. I never stop focusing on my son, you know. So I feel like that's just never the case. I'm very genuinely happy. It's just the fact that all this stuff came out of the blue. I was not expecting this. It's just why I was like, all right, I'm about to delete this video because this girl that came out the blue said something that I didn't like. So you know what? I'm going to just literally go back into a shell, go back into a hole, and let's forget this ever happened. That's how I feel. Felt. Can I join your live? Oh, snap. People can join lives? How do you do that? Hold on. Oh. And that's where it happens. As you see up, up above, um, from as you, as you see on top where it says Angela requests to be part of your live, and she didn't know what she was doing. She clicked on it, and it glitched, and then that was it. Um, that's pretty much where it ends, but everybody kept commenting. But, yeah. Some of these um, fans' comments were very interesting. Very interesting, but...